Urea cream is commonly used to treat dry, rough skin conditions like eczema, psoriasis, corns, and calluses, as well as some nail problems such as ingrown nails. It can also help remove dead tissue in wounds to promote healing. As a keratolytic, urea works by increasing moisture in the skin and softening the horny substance that holds the top layer of skin cells together. This helps the dead skin cells to fall off and allows the skin to retain more water. It's important to use urea cream as directed by your doctor or pharmacist. Typically, it is applied to the affected area once or twice a day, and it's best to apply it at the same time each day for the best results. Make sure to use this product as directed, following all the instructions on the product package or prescription label. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask your doctor or pharmacist for clarification. Some products may need to be shaken well before use, so be sure to check the label for instructions. Apply the cream to the affected areas of the skin or nails as directed by your doctor, usually one to three times a day. Rub it in well until it's fully absorbed, and remember to wash your hands after applying unless you are treating the hands. The frequency of application will depend on the specific product and your skin condition. Only apply the cream to the skin or nails, avoiding sensitive areas like your eyes, lips, inside your mouth or nose, and the vaginal or groin area, unless directed otherwise by your doctor. Make sure to consult your doctor or check the label for any specific directions on where not to apply the cream, such as the face, broken or irritated skin, or recently shaved skin. Additionally, ask your doctor if you should cover the treated area with a bandage or gauze, and for any further details. It's important to use this medication regularly to get the most benefit from it. And make sure to inform your doctor if your condition persists or worsens. Some common side effects of urea cream keratolytics include burning, itching, stinging, redness, or irritation. If these effects persist or worsen, it's important to notify your doctor or pharmacist. It's important to remember that this medication has been prescribed because your doctor believes the benefits outweigh the potential side effects. While many people using this medication do not experience serious side effects, it's essential to inform your doctor immediately if you experience unusual changes in the skin, such as blistering or peeling, or signs of a skin infection. Although very rare, a serious allergic reaction to this drug may occur. Seek medical help immediately if you notice symptoms such as rash, itching slash swelling, severe dizziness, or trouble breathing. This is not an exhaustive list of possible side effects, so if you notice any other effects, it's crucial to contact your doctor or pharmacist for further guidance. Before using urea cream keratolytics, it's important to talk to your doctor or pharmacist if you have any allergies. This cream may contain ingredients that can cause allergic reactions or other problems, so it's best to check with your pharmacist for more details. If you have a history of skin cuts, infections, or sores, be sure to inform your doctor or pharmacist before using this medication. Some products may also make your skin more sensitive to the sun, so it's important to check the label for any warnings and ask your doctor or pharmacist if you need to take any special precautions when in the sun. Your doctor may recommend limiting your time in the sun, avoiding tanning booths and sunlamps, and using sunscreen and protective clothing when outdoors. If you experience sunburn or skin blisters slash redness, be sure to tell your doctor right away. In addition, some products may stain or discolor clothing, so it's best to ask your doctor or pharmacist for more details on how to prevent this. If you are pregnant, it's important to use this medication only when clearly needed and to discuss the risks and benefits with your doctor. It is also unknown if this drug passes into breast milk, so it's best to consult your doctor before using this medication, especially if you are applying it to the breast area. When using urea cream keratolytics, it's important to be aware of potential drug interactions that could impact how the medication works or increase the risk of side effects. Make sure to keep a list of all the products you use, including prescription and non-prescription drugs, as well as any herbal products, and share this with your doctor and pharmacist. It's crucial to not make any changes to the dosage or start or stop any medications without first consulting with your doctor. This will help ensure the safe and effective use of urea cream keratolytics. If this cream is accidentally swallowed, it can be harmful. If someone has taken too much and is experiencing severe symptoms like fainting or difficulty breathing, it's important to call for emergency help. In the US, 
you can reach out to your local poison control center at 1-800-222-1222, and Canadian residents can call a provincial poison control center for assistance. Remember, it's important not to share this medication with others. This medication has been prescribed specifically for your current condition. It's not recommended to use it for a different condition unless instructed to do so by your doctor. In that case, a different medication may be necessary. If you forget to use the urea cream keratolytics, topical, general, use it as soon as you remember. But if it's almost time for your next dose, then just skip the missed dose and use the next one at your regular time. Don't try to make up for the missed dose by using more of the cream or using it more frequently. Stick to the recommended usage. When using urea cream keratolytics, it's important to store it at room temperature and avoid freezing it. If you have the foam product, make sure to keep it away from heat and open flame. Since the foam canister is pressurized, avoid puncturing or burning the container. Keep all medications out of reach of children and pets. When it comes to disposing of the product, do not flush it down the toilet or pour it into a drain unless specifically instructed to do so. Make sure to properly discard the product and it is expired or no longer needed. It's best to consult your pharmacist or local waste disposal company for the proper way to dispose of it. If you need more help, call your doctor for medical advice. In the US, you call FDA, 1-800-FDA-1088. In Canada, you may call Health Canada, 1-866-234-2345. Wishing you good health. Thanks for watching.